In this cosmic play of the universe in its divine symphony, we often direct our hearts to reaching out our wishes and desires with such a truthful, pure, and genuine intentions, but despite that intensity and extent of our wish, we don't reach the place we aspired for. Why is it so wide to get stuck in the storms of unaccomplished desires, goals, and wishes? See, the journey of your life is mysterious and magical. It is. Magical and infinite in nature, it is though simple, but has considerable complex and intricate nature as well, that to most of the times, it does not take you straight forward to the place where you are aspiring to go, where you want to head the place of your dreams. You have to put some efforts to reach the place of your desires and goals. The path of manifestation is not always easy and linear. It involves going through complex level of strategic approaches and mindful use of the cosmic energy. These complexities and intricate behavior of the universe is not there to stop us from reaching our goals. Instead, these are the guide that stimulate our true personality, our inside, to be aware of what we are doing, and whether that doing aligns with our divine destiny or not. It is a divine pilgrim that prepares you, makes you ready. To accept the and be completely worthy of the things you are aspiring for. Every step, every challenge or a trial that the universe throws to you is a checkpoint that determines and direct every step that you take towards your destiny. And if that step is not towards your destiny or you are not prepared for that step, then the universe makes you pass through its pre-planned tests so that you can become worthy of what you are aspiring for and where and what you are heading towards. Each challenges or trial has a cosmic significance that not only explores the innate and deep nature and commitment of your being, but also prepares you and provides you with divine potential to conquer every challenge that you might face onward towards your journey to your destination. The celestial challenges are actually a whisper from the divine that guides you towards the heaven of your dreams. Now, once you become able to overcome all these challenges and trials that you encounter, the universe begins unfolding the infinite treasures and divine control to you that has been locked away from you, but now you have access to them all. If you truly want all your dreams to get manifested into physical reality, you have to pass through the mystical cosmic settings. Although the journey evolves around cosmic trials and challenges, but it is the only path leading you towards your true destiny, there is no other way around to tell you the truth. Most of the people don't get through these challenges and trials. Instead, they get stuck trying foolish things, making useless attempts, why it happens. So because they don't know the proper pattern, the proper functioning of the universe. Remember, whenever you are heading towards any desires, you encounter setback, and this is where most of the people falter. They become insecure, begin being skeptical, doubtful, worried, anxious, and begin to produce more negative feeling. What these negative feeling do is they block the proper functioning of your mind and disrupt your cosmic intelligence and divine control over the cosmos this way. You get entrapped in into an endless pit, but there are others as well who are totally opposite. They take the challenges and trials the right way. They accept as divine tasks to overcome these cascades of challenges appear as stepping stones to them, and they always take these challenges with positivity and optimism. See, the challenges might seem antithesis of your desires, but believe in the divinity of everything. And they know that ultimately all these challenges and trials are going to take you closer to your destiny. See, the universe works in a way that it makes you pass through unexpected detour and troubles that apparently might seem big, but in reality they are he helping ingredients the catalyst that take you closer to your destiny and make you travel fast towards one you completely. Overuse of these challenges and cross them with your consistent attempts then there is nothing in the universe that can stand against you, because at this point in time, the whole universe begin being your side. Each and everything helps you conquer the problems on your way. If somehow you don't take these challenges positively, you will find them as hurdles, obstacles, that will always pull you back, and you will begin questioning even the God and your existence. 
You would generate such intentions and feelings that will make you rebel against the God, and you yourself will begin working against your desires and wishes. See, it is the universal law that if you become negative towards the universe, its entities, and the God, then the universe introduces you to such challenges, situations, circumstances, and scenario that you will unknowingly begin working against your goals and desires. And if that is happening, my friends, then it is time to be conscious and vigilant of all the things you are doing, all the intentions and mental approaches you have. It is time to make them positive and optimistic. Otherwise, there is nothing in the whole universe that gets you out of the infinite pit of disparity into which you yourself fell. Change your thinking from negative to positive, pessimistic to optimistic. It is time to take the charge of your soul and spirit and throw the devil out from your life. Once you become aware and conscious of your thoughts and intentions and wishes that you have nailed it, you have won your battle with the devil of your life that kept you backward. Miserable conditions. This awareness of yours ill begin making you vigilant and wise towards your actions or thoughts. Now you will become more steadfast, firm, and resolute. You will begin developing positivity about each and everything that you encounter directly or indirectly. Now you know that every challenge that you encounter, the divine throw it to you for a reason. It will give a boost towards your journey. Each trial is a litmus test that certifies your eligibility for the things you are. Aspiring for each trial is a question that asks whether you are eligible and worthy of the things that you want in your life. Let me give you an example of this so that you can better understand and this overall divine working of the universe. Picture this in your mind, that you want financial freedom, you want to be abundant, you want to have unlimited wealth and enjoy limitless prosperity. What do you think it requires? Do you feel that with the mindset that you have now, the ability of yours that you posey, now the feelings, emotions, and intentions that you hold now are eligible for the wishes that you are aspiring for. Think it deeply. When you do so, you will find that you have to take a complete shift from these old held belief and behaviors of yours. You have to overcome them all and change them as per the requirements of your wishes and desires. Financial freedom requires you to evolve into a person who has the potential to hold the responsibility of the wealth and abundance that the universe is gifting you, have to be completely aware of the deep and profound nature of it. See, the world is ever-growing and infinite in nature. The people living in it are always in want of more. They want everything more. Whether they are Capable of that thing or not, they don't think they just want it in their lives. And that is where the role of universe's trials come into view. The universe puts the trials in front of man so that it can judge who is worthy and eligible and who is not. These trials often text our commitment, consistency, and education to whatever we are aspiring for. They are like mystic riddles that has been set to unfold our diligence and intelligence. They are the mirror that reflect the real personality of a person to the universe. They test whether our desire belong to our inside, whether they are from our heart, whether we truly want it. Once you cross the ocean of challenges, you become a beacon of light that divinely aligns all your actions and reactions towards your desires and wishes. There appears a universal cosmic force that begin helping us. In every step that we take, in every direction that we begin moving to, in each and everything, the universal energy is there to help you. This journey not only helps you reach your goals and desires, but helps you discover the true depths of hidden realities of your personality deep down inside you. These challenges compel you to look inside. They stimulate you to take certain actions to tell you the truth. The more challenges you face, the more close you reach to your destination. The more close you reach to your destination, the more you know about yourself. The more you know yourself, the more you explore your spiritual nature, finally leading to make you realize the divinity hidden inside you see. When it comes about manifestation, it does not only mean the universe is just giving a reply for your questions, it far. More than that, it is actually reflecting back what you throw towards it. 
It is reflecting back to us what our true essence is, what we hold inside. See, it is not a gen grading wishes, but it is a divine creation that gives each and every one what he deserves. The universe being divine in nature is just and honest in its dealings with the people it always gives one. What one deserves, see. I am not just saying it for the sake of saying most of the scholars and even the creeds of the world exclaim the same thing they say that God gives you only what you deserve and to check whether you deserve a thing or not. God gives you challenges to overcome that finally lead you towards growth and evolution to make you completely understand this. Let me give you a comprehensive approach to look at things differently so that you can reach the true depths of it, the universe, and all the processes happening in it, work of the principle of vibration, frequency, and resonation of energy. See, all the universe and everything in it is actually divine energy and they all are connected to one another through a universal law that we name as the law of vibration. To understand this principle, let me introduce to a concept that we name as vibrational law. It states that everything, whether tangible and non-tangible, vibrates at its certain frequency, and everything attracts every other thing, if they both have the same frequency and resonate with each other equally. Now from here, we can easily conclude that the secret to getting any desire manifested is to match the vibration of your body with the vibration of the things that you wish for if you genuinely resonate with. Those things then there will be nothing in the whole cosmos that can stop you from getting it manifested into physical reality. Now the big question, what is the process to match your vibration with the vibration of desires and wishes? Well, the vibration oh, our body solely depend upon the intensity and gentility of our thoughts, emotions, and intentions. If your thoughts, emotions, and intentions are as per your desires and wishes, then you nailed it. Your body will now generate such vibrations that will exactly match your desires and wishes and will resonate with them, ultimately bringing them into physical reality. I know there is a burning question inside you, that if it is so, then why most of the people, despite having thoughts, intentions, and feelings relevant to their desires, don't resonate with the required frequency? Well, the answer to this question is simple. They don't get their desires manifested because from deep down they vibrate differently. They are not honest with their desires and wishes, or they are not sure of them. No doubt, they generate the relevant emotions, thoughts, and intentions, but they are only at the surface level. They don't have the courage to bear the hardship and face the trials and challenges put by the universe as a litmus test for the manifestation of their desires and wishes.